Hey, what's going on guys? It's your boy WorldLimmer4 today showing you how to do a round skip glitch on Kino de Toten. It's a super easy glitch. You're gonna get tons of XP and you're gonna level up extremely fast. This glitch works on both gens being Xbox and PS. And the only downside of this glitch is you're gonna need two controllers. But if you have two controllers, then you're all set. So let's hop straight into this. So the first thing you're gonna wanna do is if you have Black Ops 3 running, you're just gonna wanna close out of it. So quit the application. Then you're gonna wanna go to settings. You're gonna wanna go offline, then load up Black Ops 3 again. Once you get to the starting menu, you're gonna wanna press A. Then you're going to wanna reconnect to the internet and then go back to Black Ops 3. All you're gonna wanna do is go down to play online, hit A. It's gonna ask if you wanna play online again. So you're gonna hit A, then you're gonna back out, then pause. So A, B, pause. If done correctly, it should flash your screen after 10 to 15 seconds of waiting. And if you look at the bottom left corner, you could see press A to start. So you're gonna to wanna to press A to start. Then you're gonna press A again to select zombies. Now that you're at this part, you're gonna to wanna to get your second controller, press A to join the lobby. Now with your second controller, you're gonna to wanna to go to private game, then to weapons kit. You're gonna to wanna to scroll over to the secondaries and click on Bowie knife once. Now with your first controller, you're gonna to wanna to press A. Now go back to your second controller and press B three times. You'll know if you've done it right if your screen looks like my screen. Now still with your second controller, you're gonna to wanna to press A, then scroll to secondaries, and then press on Bowie knife once. Now back to your first controller, you're gonna to wanna to scroll to the Shiva. You're gonna to wanna to create a variant. You're gonna to have to give it a name. Just name it whatever you want, hit confirm. If you had any attachments on the gun, get rid of them. You're gonna add a whole bunch of new attachments, and these attachments should go in order. So attachment one is quick draw. The second attachment will be the suppressor. The third attachment will be the F FMJ. The fourth attachment will be extended mags and the fifth attachment will be rapid fire. Once that is done, all you have to do is back out and save. Make sure you delete any other variants. That's not the one that you just created. You only need one variant and that is the one you just created. If everything looks good, all you have to do is completely back out of Black Ops 3 and then load it back up. And if you wanted to check and make sure it's all done properly, all you have to do is go to weapons kit when you load back up, go to the assault rifles, go back to Shiva and the attachment should be placed in the order you place them in, with FMJ being right in the middle. Now that you set up the glitch Shiva, you are ready to do the glitch. Now it would help if you use some gobble gum, those two being Fatal Contraption and Wall Power. It's not needed to use gobble gum, but it would speed it up immensely. I'm going to show you the method without it, and then I'll explain how you could use Gobble Gum after. So hopefully you catch my drift. We're going to load up into Kino Der Toten, and I'm going to show you guys an easy round skip glitch by using this method. So first, you're going to have to buy yourself a secondary weapon anywhere off the box, off the wall, doesn't matter. Then you're going to want to go back to your glitch Shiva and buy that off the wall. Once you've done that, you're going to want to go pack a punch your Shiva. If done correctly, you'll notice that you can't receive it back. And when you switch over, it'll be invisible, the weapon. That's how you know you've done it correctly. Now, all you have to do is wait for a zombie to drop the death machine pickup. Once you see it dropped, all you're going to want to do is switch over to your Shiva that's invisible, pull out a grenade so it pulls out the Shiva. Then you're going to want to run to the death machine pickup and if done correctly after the death machine runs out you should still have the side effects of the death machine so the gun should be spazzing out after acting like the death machine itself now this is the long version of it just in case you might not have all the gobble gum that you might need to do this glitch now if you wanted to use gobble gum this is what you would have to do all you'd have to do is buy a secondary first then get the wall power gobble gum go up to the shiva use the wall gum power up so it has the shiva pack a punched when you pick it up then all you have to do is pull out a grenade so it pulls out the shiva then you'd have to use the gobble gum the fatal contraption to spawn in the death machine pickup then all you have to do is pick up the power up and then the glitch would have been done that quickly but since not everyone might have those two gobble gum i decided to show you guys the long way just in case you guys might want to do this glitch without them but once all is said and done and you have the death machine integrated with your shiva and it's spazzing out all you want to do is go to the corner and jug look at the specific corner i'm looking at have a hair tie or a rubber band on your firing trigger so all you have to do is just set it and forget it and the zombies will keep piling up right through that little door Doorway. so it's very easy to do very high round based easy xp level up type situation and make sure to remember guys that when you're doing this glitch just to let the death machine run out and don't press y and just don't press y in general because it'll mess up the glitch in itself and make sure you guys don't throw any grenades or happen to go down because that will also mess up the glitch and a little bit of helpful advice and if you guys did use gobble gum all you have to do is back out of the game entirely instead of ending it itself so don't end the game don't go 
down just close the application or black ops 3 in itself out so you guys keep all the liquid divinium gobble gum and xp that you got without wasting all the gobble gum but super easy simple glitch and if you guys did enjoy please leave a like subscribe turn on notification hopefully you guys enjoyed this video it's been your boy world number four and i'm out peace Thank <laughs> you.